homes in New Jersey are without power, and some people are even trapped in their homes after a truck crashed into utility poles, knocking down live wires. CBS 2's Jessica Borg has more live from Parsippany this noon. Jessica. Well, Chris, right now, uh, crews are very busy trying to get power back on for those hundreds of customers. A spokesperson for JCPNL tells me currently there are 773 people without power. That's actually down from 1,865 customers from when this accident first happened. But for some folks here at this apartment complex, power is not the problem. They have not been able to leave their homes all morning because of down wires. The accident happened here at Manor Condominiums, a sprawling residential complex in Parsippany. Authorities say a garbage truck making routine stops at about 8 this morning hit a utility pole, knocking down wires and a second utility pole. Power was knocked out to more than 700 people, and some residents say they're trapped in their apartments while crews fix the problem. Resident Keith Dudiak says his friend and neighbor called him to cancel plans. The wires were on his front porch, so he couldn't even get out, so I guess they're keeping them trapped. Verizon is in the process of replacing the utility poles, and then crews with JCPNL can restore power to customers. Jim Green is anxious for that to happen. He's the head maintenance worker for the complex. Well, my concern is the temperature is dropping, and I got boiler rooms without electric right now. Green says a member of his maintenance crew was in the middle of it all when the poles and wires came crashing down. It's a fighting situation, I imagine, you know, seeing two telephone poles break in half and Funny. Now, Parsippany police tell me they do have an accident investigator looking into how this happened. Fortunately, no injuries reported. And keep in mind, this happened at 8 in the morning when many people here at this complex are leaving their homes, heading into their cars. And I'm told power will likely be restored to the surrounded area sometime this afternoon, but that it is also likely that four residential buildings here at the complex will not get their power back on until sometime later this evening. That's the very latest from Parsippany, New Jersey this afternoon. I'm Jessica Borg, CBS 2 News.